impossible. You could not critique a woman after a date and post that and think you're going to get a positive review. So you think social media is a women's playground? 100%. Yo, and women are get, kind of getting caught up because we're talking about this whole, like, putting your life out there to try and monetize it and everything. I think there's some women who get in, that endeavor into some areas on social media that can be hard to come back from. You know, or it's hard to remove that sort of connotation if you're an OnlyFans and you have a crazy OnlyFans and you're known as that, and then you kind of want to rebrand or something. The and you BBL rebrand. I agree, and I uh, like it. You like the rebrand? No, I like now that people have to. <laughs> when they choose God, like the the God rebrand, I don't like that. No, I don't. I like, like the fact. No, but like to your point, yeah. I like the fact that now people are being like held to their actions yeah, yeah i know that people say everyone deserves a second chance and all that type of stuff but now i feel like because people don't understand like your actions have consequences and a lot of people were not taking that in with a lot of things they were doing on social media mm. and i like the fact that now people are starting to face the consequences for these actions that they made before mm. i like that so like i know you're usually like you're talking about like Black China and all those people, but I want to before Renner's we get to stuff. her, I want to talk about the average person because we love to talk about guys and guys that want to rap and guys that that tried to make the league that didn't make it. The, the I think the uh, the crazier good, thing yeah. than the girls that did OnlyFans and are popping on OnlyFans are the girls that made OnlyFans. And it didn't work. And now they try to just remove all of that like it didn't <laughs> happen. We know you made an OnlyFans. You made $17. You put your coochie on the internet. Okay, come on. Nobody bought it. And now you're trying to take it all the away. North no, we, we saw. Are there women who actually like try OnlyFans and it doesn't work? In I've absolute, seen, I've seen like more than five, Zoe. Zoe. Really? I, I don't I know. I, honestly, I've never subscribed to OnlyFans. I don't but look you're only forgetting. Fans, so I don't Remember. Know. You, you see how certain girls, their OnlyFans, they'll be like, oh, top 0.1%. Right, right. For there to be a 0.1%, there has to be a 100%. <laughs> so 99% of those girls didn't make didn't it. Didn't make it. And they just try to just do it on the hush, <laughs> take it away, delete the page, and now you're back to regular. Right. No, I remember you were four ninety nine. You were four ninety nine. Your page was four ninety nine, and it didn't work. So all I'm saying is you have to be able to stand on that. And there's nothing wrong. What I'm saying is it's not that there's anything necessarily Why wrong with that. that? You <laughs> 499. Why would you crazy. say that? You were 499. You were 499, bitch. <laughs> like it is what it is, bro. You didn't have to say that. Why'd you say it like that? It's true. Facts. But it's true. Cause everyone's thinking, yo, I'm gonna blow. Nobody's thinking, yo, if this doesn't work. And now these pictures that I wouldn't have wanted anyone to see, mm. someone has them now because I want to charge five dollars for them. Sorry to interrupt. Can you like save photos on OnlyFans? Well, you I guess yes. Screenshot. You can screenshot oh, yeah, anything. You can easily screenshot Reddit. and send it to people. Reddit has the most OnlyFans content the ever. I've never paid for. I've never paid for a single OnlyFan. <laughs> I've never paid for a fan. <laughs> I'm on Reddit. You're fucked. I'm on Reddit. I've never bro. been an OnlyFans. Yeah. yeah, I think when it comes, yeah, you're right. I do agree that that's people permanent. don't. A you lot of women, even OnlyFans. sometimes men, don't necessarily think too, about yeah. you know the repercussions of doing certain things, whether it's online or you know mm -hmm. changes to your body and stuff. Like you don't really like think like long term. And I'm a very long term thinker. Like exactly. I always think like, yo, how am I going to feel about this in 10 years? Exactly. That's what like when it comes to like plastic surgery and stuff like that, like that's why women don't realize like, yo, in 10 years, your BBL is not going to sit the same. In 10 years, you're, you have to get your breasts. Like if you get breasts, you have to get them done every 10 to 12 years. Mm -hmm. People forget that. Like in order to keep your breast implants intact and well, you have to get them done every 10 to 12 years. People, oh yeah, I want my boobs done right now. Because I'm going to look hot. They're going to sit sexy. I'm in my 20s, whatever, whatever. Okay. But one day, they're either going to have to get removed or get replaced. And what happens in 13 years when your son comes home crying because his, his, the people in his class are showing him naked pictures of you? Okay. <laughs> that's happened. No, that's a serious... Like, oh, serious, you mean the only fans? Yeah. Okay, I that's happened. Yeah, I'm sure it's happened, for that sure. That is... Not, like, people don't Didn't think that happen with Kim Kardashian with uh, St. West and... He saw like an ad for her sex tape on Roblox yes. like that. That must feel you must feel terrible. Yeah, and I get it. You know, sometimes it's mistakes, and you know, you might have needed cash quickly or whatever. Everyone has situations where you know they might have felt desperate. But some people, I would say, 
majority of people, majority of people is for are just greed. doing it because <laughs> it's, 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 it's trend and you know you saw a girl it's make greed, that much much and you want to try it like i know girls who probably have decent jobs like wasn't there a teacher or a principal who just got fired for having yeah, only fans? That often, there was man. a teacher a that lot. got fired a lot because like a student found her yeah. only fans. Yeah, but I seen a guy get fired for the same. I thing, saw a too. man get fired. I think it was a man. I saw yeah. a, a article about a man. I don't know if he was a lawyer or a teacher. He had a good, a pretty decent career, I would think, and he had only fans, and he got fired. It's crazy. I think you're right. Like I said, sometimes you know, I get it. You may need the money. You know, it's quick cash, whatever, whatever. Um. Other times, I think, yeah, a lot of women just think, like, yo, I could be the next, I don't know who the OnlyFans girls are, but I could be the next ex, whatever. and Next Britney it, Renner? Yeah, I don't know how much I don't think she Renner did OnlyFans, but um, I just think someone like her is interesting because she, like, had this brand of, like, y- like, she made a book about it where she sleeps with different guys and... She, isn't she dating like a guy in the Hornets, PJ Washington or whatever? She, she was. was. She had a baby she has a kid. She has a yeah, like whole him. kid with him. And, oh. mm-hmm. Like, and now she has this whole religious the rebrand. aspect to it. Does I, the religion piece bother you when women, like, when women who were, like, you know, like, only fans or, like, very, like, Not, like, the tri- religion aspect, but just, like, like he said, like, I remember when you were four ninety nine. Like, <laughs> don't, like, don't virtue, si- I hate, maybe it's that, the virtue signaling. Because mm. you know what it is, especially, and especially why a lot of, I think women thought that men had a problem with it because, Women are taking control of their bodies and they're making money without us. I don't think that is necessarily the issue. I think the issue was like, guys are like, yo, you girls are lying and you girls that are believing it are stupid because these women are not living their raps. Mm. You know what I mean? Well, it's what sells. All the girls. Yeah, but like they're not li- like the Megs, Cardi's, City Girls, all of them have boyfriends. They have husbands and they're and now you guys are out in the street talking about scam this, I want to bag this and that and they're not living that. The well, JT was living it. JT went to jail. Yeah. Well, a majority <laughs> of them like all those JT's girls, man sassy. They weren't hell. on that. Oh, see, but I don't now, like you sassy anymore. Oh my god. But that's a but thing. With guys sassy savage. A lot of those toxic quote unquote guys they were really like that. Future's really like that. Mm. Brent's really like that. You know, like, so I think guys are like, bro, you girls are being foolish following after these girls that aren't even doing what they're saying. But, and, and then now they're trying to do the cleanup and it's like, come on. All right. Like we knew it this just bothers coming. me when you get on your knees on camera and then you get your knees in front of God. Like the switch up is so weird. To me. Okay. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh my God. All right. Mike off. Mike off. This is why. This is why. <laughs> Let's go. You, are you can't just say things like that. Well, you can repent, I mean, and okay. you can turn your life yeah, around. Yeah, you can't just say, get okay. on your knees and forget, like... In all, in, all, in, all, in all seriousness, like, if you... God make, accepts all his children, if you make, on your knees if you or make, not. If you make certain <laughs> choices, like, you live with them, obviously, but, like, right. if you're a content creator specifically, and you're known for doing sinful things, and you involve <laughs> religion in them, it just... To me, it just it just feels, like, in... It feels distasteful. You think it's fake? Like it's like it's like no. It's I won't. Just I won't say fake because I won't. I won't. Dis, I won't uh, discourage people who actually want to get right with God. I won't discourage that. But like, it's just like a plea three hundred and sixty when things go wrong, and then you involve religion in order to save yourself. I think it's a plan from the beginning. Like, yeah. Did you? Maybe, my thing yeah. is, did you genuinely want to rebrand, or did something not go in your favor? Like, my yeah. thing is, if everything was going completely well, they'd still be doing it. And you're like, actually, you know what? I don't know if I want this anymore. Even though I'm still making. Crazy amount of money. Or did things start to plummet and you're like, yo, I need to rebrand because I'm not doing yeah, where I thought I this was going to go. I think things were probably happening. Mm. And it's not necessarily you losing money, but it could be, like you said, it could be your kid now is aware of what you do and you don't like how that feels. Right. So now you want to stop. Disingenuous virtue signaling and moral superiority. That's kind of what bothers me. It's not the words. religious... I don't know what that means. Moral yeah. superiority. Like, I'm better than you because I'm a more I'm a oh, more yeah, holy yeah, yeah, person yeah, yeah, yeah. than you, you know? Right. And it's like you were preaching all these things. Like, uh, yeah. I don't think anything is wrong with the rebrand, but I do think that, there, like, once there's, I wouldn't call it a stain, but once there's, you know, something to your name, it may, it's always going to be to your name. I just don't think a lot of the rebrands are genuine. That's my thing. Right. Yeah. If it's, it's genuine, genuine, then cool. But I don't think a lot of them are genuine. Yeah. It's I feel like out. once you have that, you know, little, oh, you know, you did this. Once you have something connected to them that's not held to a high standard by the masses, you're always going to have that. 
like Kim Kardashian's always going to be the girl who sucked yeah. Ray J's dick on camera. Like it's it's not yeah. like once you have that you you have it. Same with not to go into like Jonathan Majors. Like we don't know what happened, but the fact that it came out that he was in a domestic violence case, it's going to be stained. And like I said, we don't know. I'm not going to go into it. I just said, but once yeah, the allegation something is there, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because then you know it's going to be like, oh, you know, oh, Kenner statement because they paid her or Disney made the call or whatever. Once it's there, unfortunately, it's there. It's hard to that keep sucks. your nose very clean. That's crazy. It's bro. very once you're at that stage or where you're coming, it's hard to keep your nose clean. Word. Once there's a stain, it's hard to wipe off. 